So I've been in marketing for more than 20 years now, but never had the chance to work on a commercial of this nature. I'm really, really glad that my first piece of creative work with Equinox Productions has been designed in this form. It's been an absolute pleasure to work with this team. It's a wonderful crew. It's Rajiv's first ad film with us. Rajiv has been a client for us all his life and this is the first time he's directing. I have my right hand and left hand over here making it feel like a breeze. We had multiple sets here and uh, uh, we had to make it look like it's seamless even though it's travelling from one world to another world. Uh, the lighting had to flow in terms of being seamless and so we, we devised a few devices and I think, I think both the director Rajiv and Abba, uh, they were fabulous. I think, you know, we just aided what, what they created, the vibe that was created on set and there's an energy in this film. And I'm sure when you guys watch it, you're going to enjoy it. So building multiple setups for a one take shot becomes an extremely technical process because the set needs to be planned for the exact length and size for the duration of the action and the movement of the camera. See the thinking process was very hand in hand with the production design of the entire setup. The colour palletting, how the colour sort of uh, popped with the wardrobe that was put in each setup was really important for us, creating these spaces where you could be sort of transported in from the college corridor to these. So that sort of colour palletting was very very integral for this entire project. When I found out this was happening in one continuous take, as a hair and makeup designer, obviously my first thought was how can I design a look that is going to remain the same uh, throughout the film without having too many continuity jumps. It was quite challenging because we had to take a lot of different takes to get the timing right, but I totally enjoyed my experience. It was fun and something different.